Hello everyone and welcome to this video. This is a little update because one particular YouTuber called Edwin Van has asked about the AC511 uh, speaker bar which is uh, this one here. Um, he's asked about the cable, said it's a bit short to reach his PC. Um, it is quite long, um, and I just wanted to do an update um, to advise you guys on how this works, how good it is, how it sounds, and how to install it in your computer. Um, because some people, um, because some people are experiencing problems, sound issues, um, possibly it not working at all depending on what machine you're using on um, and I thought I'd do another video to help you guys um, and hopefully update you on how it works so keep tuned, keep watching and I'll tell you all about it thank you here you can see the front of the AC511 speaker bar for the Dell monitor now this particular speaker bar will fit other Dell monitors the particular one I've got it works on is the 2714H. Uh, I've done a review on that monitor if you'd like to check out my videos for that. Just to show you the side view we've basically got uh, a little dial for changing the volume up and down. On this end you have a headphone socket and a line in socket. What that means is you can connect your device up um, using a smartphone um, mobile device and you can play your music through this speaker bar but it does have to be connected to a power source such as a computer on the back of it it's quite simple we don't have anything on the back of it apart from a cable which is your USB cable quite standard on this particular one it has um, a cable length of 55 centimeters However, I did purchase one a couple of months ago and as you can see it's about 20 centimeters long this cable not very long at all. I don't quite understand why Dell has done this possibly to save costs um, but this one was purchased uh, more recently and this one with the short cable which is 20 centimeters long was purchased more recently. So it seems to me Dell has decided to try and skimp on costs and make the cable a lot shorter. Okay ladies and gentlemen. Okay here is the speaker bar um, which is called the AC511 that fits on your Dell monitor. Basically you have two notches on here which attach underneath the monitor um, and basically you um, lock it on and move it to the right and it will stay in place and lock under your monitor. On the other side of the uh, USB speaker bar we have uh, a standard USB connection. Um, the cable the cable is quite long as you can see but just for just to help you guys out, I'm just going to measure it for you. It measures approximately the cable fully extended measures approximately 55 centimeters in length, so it's quite long. As I was saying, this cable that's come with this particular model, which is the AC511 Dell speaker bar, um, the actual cable length on this particular one is 55 centimeters long however there's a little twist to little, this little story so let's just move that out of the way here we have the same model number same product um, the reason I had two is because I've got two monitors and as you can see the cable is significantly shorter so let's measure that one so that measures approximately um, 26 centimeters 
this particular cable is pr at least half the length. Um, I don't know why Dell's done this on this particular model. What I can tell you is, what I can tell you is, this was purchased in July 2015, and this other one with the longer cable was purchased in 2000. What I can what I can tell you is, this particular speaker bar was purchased in September 2015. So. There is a difference. Um, here is the Dell speaker. We need to attach it to the monitor. So what you first do is take the sticky adhesive covers that's covering the slots up. Then you just slot it in like that and then slide it across so it locks. And then it's locked in place and I'll show you the back of the monitor. Okay guys, we've uh, plugged the uh, USB soundbar into the USB hub in the back of the monitor and we've connected the uh, USB hub to the laptop so let's just play it hello just wanted to show you the type of cable you, you will be using for the, the USB hub on the back of the LCD monitor it's uh, an A to B um, cable which is basically found on lots of different types of printers before they became Wi-Fi and they still exist on uh, modern day printers even today but I just wanted to show you the type of cable you would need um, to connect your laptop um, using USB or your desktop so I just hope this video has been very helpful Thank you. Hello, I'm just going to show you some examples of video and music, uh, just to give you an idea of what the soundbar sounds like. Right, the speaker's been connected, and I'll just play the music again for you so you can get a, a, an idea of what it sounds like. <laughs> That's the little knob. Thank you.